kids these days, my dad used to say it, and now I find myself saying it. My name is Bruce Andrews. I'm the executive director of the Shelby County Arts Council. I came to know the Arts Council by teaching art in a local juvenile detention facility, the Shelby County Juvenile Detention Facility. I ask myself, and you might ask yourself, where did these kids turn bad? And how can we prevent it? How can we be proactive in our community? What I want to talk to you about today is a program called Writing Our Stories. We need your help to continue this program. It's an effective program. It's a proven program. It's a program that was developed by the Alabama Writers Forum out of Montgomery, Alabama. We, the Shelby County Arts Council, took that program about five years ago, redesigned it, tweaked it a little bit with the Alabama Writers Forum, and began to teach it at Columbiana Middle School through the teaching writer, Tony Crunk. Tony Crunk manages to go into a classroom situation of seventh graders and get them all involved in the process of creative writing. At the end of 10 weeks, they come up with a published book. So a bunch of seventh graders can say, I am a published author. Why the seventh grade? A major turning point is sixth, seventh, and eighth grade. In other words, if you go to somebody that knows anything about the prison system, they'll tell you that the last time that some at-risk kids can be turned is between the sixth, seventh, and eighth grade. The reason I'm coming to you right now is we want to expand this program to Montevallo Middle School. We are going to expand it to Montevallo Middle School. Everything's lined up. It's going to cost about $22,000. We're $8,000 short. That's the bad news. The good news is we're $15,000 to the good already, thanks to Alabama Power, thanks to the Alabama State Council on the Arts, and thanks to Senator Cam Ward. But we need your help. We're about $8,000 short. Can you change the world? No, but we can change our community. We can elevate our community. We can uh, plant good seeds in the youth that are coming up by giving them lifetime skills of being able to to uh, master the art of creative writing. 